If there were awards for cultural diversity among countries, Malaysia would undoubtedly take the lead. Malaysia represents a fusion of varied ethnic cultures, integrating an array of customs, culinary traditions, and religious beliefs in a peaceful coexistence. Its geographical diversity is equally remarkable, ranging from sprawling island archipelagos and towering mountain ranges to lush highlands and dense tropical rainforests. Adding to its uniqueness, Malaysia is split into two primary regions. West Malaysia forms the southern part of the peninsula it shares with Thailand, while East Malaysia is located on the island of Borneo, separated by the South China Sea. And what are the recommended things to do in Malaysia? On the main peninsula, you'll tour the capital of Kuala Lumpur, visit famous cave temples, and see the highlights of Penang Island. Then you're off to Borneo, in East Malaysia, where you'll relax on remote beaches, go snorkeling, and visit Gunung Mulu National Park and its caves. Here is a list of 10 awesome things you should consider doing should you ever visit this gorgeous country. And don't forget, if you love traveling, hit the like and subscribe button to join us on more amazing journeys. Let's begin. Number one, take a tour of Kuala Lumpur. Any journey to Malaysia should start in Kuala Lumpur, the nation's capital and largest city. Although at first it may seem like a sprawling metropolis, once you've found your feet, you'll realize that this is the heart of modern Malaysia. Old markets and colonial buildings stand in the shadow of the brightly lit Petronas Towers and gleaming skyscrapers. There's food, intriguing museums, and a diverse blend of Malay, Chinese, Indian, and European influences to discover across this vibrant city. One of the most iconic sites in the world, the Petronas Towers, also known as the Petronas Twin Towers due to the fact that they come in a pair, are located in the capital city of Kuala Lumpur and are the tallest twin towers in the world. The architecture is postmodern and also features motifs found in Islamic art to represent the Muslim majority in Malaysia. The main attraction is the skywalk over the sky bridge that joins them together and visitors can admire the views that stretch across the city and Kuala Lumpur City Centre Park at the base of the towers. Number two, explore the Batu Caves. 15 kilometers from Kuala Lumpur Centre, exploring the Batu Caves is a fun day trip from the city and one of the top things to do in Malaysia. The massive limestone cliff houses a collection of caves and Hindu shrines. Displayed at the foot of the cliff is a dominating 140-foot golden statue of Lord Murugan, the god of war. There are three main caves composing the Batu Caves. However, the most famous sits perched 272 steps atop the cliff, Cathedral Cave. It is the most impressive cavern in the cave series, the interior of which is decorated with ornate Hindu shrines and features a large opening at the top where the sunlight streams through. Aside from visiting the caves to worship, travelers can also experience the local flora and fauna, including wild monkeys that inhabit the area, as well as bats that dwell in the caves. Number three glimpse a piece of paradise. The Perhentian Islands off the northeast coast of Malaysia are two tropical paradises that are an absolute must-see. Pulau Besar and Pulau Kecil, Big Island and Small Island, respectively, are two little sun-soaked jewels offering long sandy beaches, simple beach bars, and super laid-back vibes. Number four. Indulge in activities on Langkawi. Located off Malaysia's northwestern coast in the Andaman Sea, Langkawi is an archipelago of 99 islands boasting picturesque beaches, rainforest, mangroves, and forest-clad mountains, making it one of Malaysia's most popular destination. By far the largest of the islands is the eponymous Pulau Langkawi, with a population of some 65,000 the only other inhabited island being nearby Pulau Tuba. The island's natural splendor is its number one attraction. 
Beaches offer powdery white sands, crystal clear waters, limestone cliffs, and water sports. Several protected parks offer jungle trekking and mangrove tours, where visitors can experience breathtaking views of the Talaga Tuju waterfalls and exotic birds and animals like monitor lizards and makake monkeys. Gunung Raya and Gunung Mat Chinchang are Langkawi's tallest mountains with lookout points, presenting outstanding views of the area and across to Thailand. Gondola rides and the Sky Bridge are fun ways to ascend the mountains and survey the surrounding beauty. Number 5. Eat your way through Penang. Located in the Strait of Malacca off West Malaysia's northwestern coast, Penang Island is a popular tourist destination due to its historic Georgetown and rich culinary diversity. Its position along one of the world's most traveled shipping routes has infused Penang with a colorful array of cultures, architecture, and cuisine. Whether by car or public buses, Penang Island should be explored to see and experience its many attractions like the Botanic Gardens, Bird Sanctuary, Butterfly Park, and the white sandy beaches of Batu Ferengi along the north coast. Numerous temples dot the island, including the must-see Snake Temple, with its Viper residence and the huge Temple of Supreme Bliss. No visit to Penang would be complete without a trishaw ride or walk around the island's capital city, Georgetown, to see its British colonial architecture and historic Chinese and Indian temples. Number six, visit the historic town of Malacca. Charming city streets and loads of Malaysian history await two hours south of the country's capital in Malacca. The historic state has seen a huge transformation since its days as a small fishing village. Present-day Malacca has been influenced by multiple cultures as a result of a string of colonial activities. The plethora of museums and galleries are some of the other main attractions. Highlights include Christ Church, Afamosa Fort, and Malacca Sultanate Palace. After touring these three attractions, all within walking distance of one another, you'll have likely worked up an appetite. Hop across the Malacca Coastal Bridge and check out Jonker Street's electric street market for cheap eats and tons of hustle bustle. Number seven, scuba dive in Sipadan. Malaysia's only oceanic island, Sipadan lies off the east coast of Borneo, surrounded by the tropical waters of the Celebes Sea. Formed over millennia out of living coral reefs, it is now a mecca for scuba divers, who come to explore one of the world's richest marine habitats. There are a dazzling array of dives for visitors to choose from. Some take you through atmospheric underwater tunnels and caverns, and others past steep coral walls and spiraling shoals of fish. Swirling about the island are all manner of marine life, with sea turtles, hammerhead sharks, and manta rays spotted here and there. As the island has been closed since 2004 to protect its beautiful beaches and underwater riches, it is only accessible by boat from Mabul and Kapalai, both of which lie nearby. Once fought over by Malaysia and Indonesia, Sipadan is now one of the best dive destinations in the world. Number eight, explore the Gunung Mulu National Park. Famous for its extraordinary limestone karst formations and phenomenal cave systems, the Gunung Mulu National Park is one of the most awe-inspiring natural attractions in all of Southeast Asia. Located in Malaysian Borneo in the Sarawak state, this national park features some of the largest and longest cave systems in the world. Included in these is the world's largest cave chamber, the Sarawak Chamber, which is estimated large enough to hold 40 Boeing 747 aircraft. Situated among rainforest, crystal clear rivers, rugged mountains, and deep ravines, the park's other remarkable features include the pinnacles, a concentration of pointed limestone spires, a karst sinkhole known as the Garden of Eden, and two majestic peaks, Gunung Mulu and Gunung Api. The park is also home to a number of wildlife species, such as hornbills, bats, gibbons, barking deer, and bearded pigs. Number nine, 
Enjoy the hill country of Cameron Highlands. Travel three and a half hours north of Kuala Lumpur, and you'll find the endless rolling hills and lush greenery of the Cameron Highlands. You are amidst Malaysia's primary tea supply. The Cameron Highlands attractions are aplenty, a velvety emerald expanse of undulating hill country with fresh air and mild and breezy weather makes it a must visit in Malaysia. It is home to the country's fragrant tea plantations and strawberry farms sprinkled with tall eucalyptus trees, as well as Victorian gardens, sprawling colonial bungalows and golfing greens. You could trek down the area's many wooded trails, visit some of the temples dotting its hills, or stay in one of the Cameron Highlands resorts and savor stunning views with your high tea. Number 10. Embrace Kota Kinabalu. Endearingly known as KK, Kota Kinabalu is the base for everything in Sabah, the Malaysian state of Borneo. Whether you want to head off to Tunku Abdul Rahman Marine Park or do the popular activities like kayaking, snorkeling, diving, wildlife watching, and trekking Mount Kinabalu, KK is the destination. However, when here, don't just be immersed in touristic affairs. Blend in with the locals, watch its many stunning sunsets, enjoy the rich culinary scene, experience the local market, and simply embrace the city's old charm mixed and its 21st century flamboyance. Malaysia is a versatile country offering visitors secluded beaches, fantastic scuba diving, abundant nature, exotic foods, and an exclusive peek at a rich and intertwined culture. With all these places to see and things to do in Malaysia, it's common for travelers to leave wanting more and vowing to return. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more travel adventures with happy voyages. Until next time, keep exploring and creating your own unforgettable travel stories.